You're never gonna believe what I just found behind me. Let's go in and grab a baby! I heard the news today there is a lot of product right over here to the right. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We had ourselves a major time aisle there. We were able to grab the shop stool, which is right here. I got it right there, flipped upside down, and I took two extra small Home Depot boxes as well. Those always come in really, really handy, especially the extra smalls, so I don't have to cut down the smalls or mediums. But there was a lot going in that aisle way, a lot of action. We're looking real good. I just saw a guy creeping over here. I'm gonna see if I can snag a parking spot and see what he was looking at. I don't wanna scare him away because obviously, all right, what is that? Okay, we went in for a closer look with the Snapchat footage. We were able to grab a nice parking spot and take a little closer look. One fantastic piece that looked like actual granite uh, on top of that piece. And I want to roll over here real quick. I thought I saw something in the corner. Yep, one chair. Uh, we'll go ahead and let that slide here. There's somebody right next to me here. We had some sort of like post. I don't really know what that was. Maybe a hang up bar or something like that for, uh, you know, pull ups. And then what I saw the guy looking at was actually like, uh, I think maybe a, maybe a roller toolbox or a roller kind of slash cooler, something like that. Anyway, we'll go ahead and press on. And if you're wondering why I grabbed the shop stool out of all that action is there's been plenty of times where I've just need to sit down while I work on my electric dirt bikes or scooters or whatnot. So that actually comes in really handy, adjustable uh, hydraulic on there. So that's a win-win. Hey guys, if you're new here, welcome. We have a lot of fun here. Smash that subscribe button down below and turn on your bell notifications so when fresh content comes out, you're the first to know. Here we got ourselves a cooler down the pipe old uh, igloo cooler, but it still looks like we can spit shine it up for a good condition. Got himself some nice stuff in the complex. Nice. That I guarantee you is from this complex or he has to be another diver. He's the guy that I always get the Snapchat footage of that has the stuff in front of his garage. His garage must be packed to the McGillicuddy's to leave a $250 vintage bike out front with a luggage case. So he must just grab it Throw it in front of his garage, meaning like it's mine, don't take it, and then deal with it later, but not with the $250, $300 vintage bike out front. Or, actually something I just thought about, that might be a sting operation. Here we go, I spot it from already right here. What is that? That would be a couch with all the action, but that's like just a piece of a sectional. All the cushions are below it. Looks a little scuffed up from moving. We'll go ahead and pass. Funny quick story. Actually, this one is in better condition than my freeway couches. Did I ever tell you this story? So a long time ago, I had a friend, she had a truck, and we loaded up two couches, a couch and a love seat that fell out of a truck and was on the side of the highway for like a week. So obviously they didn't care about them. They didn't care to come back and pick them up. We pulled over, hit the hazards at like one o'clock in the morning and did two different times. It was still a big truck, but it couldn't hold both of them. So we actually had to do that two different times. And I call those the freeway bachelor couch. Mr. Sleepslot and I, we always joke around if we would have known about dumpster diving back when we lived together, because he was my old roommate before we both got married. If we knew about dumpster diving, we would have primo bachelor pad. Any college students, any parents that their kids are saying, hey ma, I need this. 
Hey, Ma, I need that. You know what you do? You tell them, hey, listen, you want it? You got to go find it, baby. Definitely pray about it before you go out. Hey, look at that. Got a nice little uh, mirror right here. We're going to go ahead and leave that there. Uh, was that? Yeah, I think that was just a mirror. Maybe a, yeah, I think it was just a mirror. You're never going to believe what I just found behind me. Let's go in and grab it, baby. Hoverboard, baby, hoverboard. That's an actual hoverboard. The one I have is the, uh, obviously, a one that goes a lot faster. That's more of just something you hang on the wall. That's why I grab that. I'll go ahead and put that up in my garage on display. Very, very cool. We got a lot of people right here. Let's go ahead and creep it a creep. A lot of trash right there. I probably should have took that bristle deep clean as well. What are those guys doing? That guy's in the back of a truck. Are they rolling through? Are they diving, Johnny? Are they diving without me? Let's team up and dive together. Actually, no, then I gotta split the profits. So, maybe we should go out thirds and thirds. Oh, hold on, there's something right here. Let's stay on the phone with me here, live, right here with you as I'm coming around the corner. Let's see what it is. What is it, Johnny? What do we got, Johnny? Whoa! In table, office chair, very nice office chair, a little scuffed up on the bottom. But that brand new was probably upwards $200. I'll tell you what, I'm gonna put an ad on offer up Craigslist. You meet me right here. Actually, no, you're not even gonna meet me right here. You're just gonna show up, you're gonna take it, and you're gonna slip some money. Uh, how about over here under this bush? And then I'll show back up and I'll get the money and I won't have to do anything. Somebody coming, so I gotta film it fast. There is a couch, there is a dresser, another dresser down the way, end table. What is that, an office chair as well? Uh, shelving. Is that bad? Oh, I, is that Ikea? Is that Ikea? Is that a four drawer Ikea? I think that is. Before we do donate it, I want to show you this Roadrunner key. It's only a 44 or a 60. I can't remember. I think it's only 60, maybe 44. Don't quote me on that one. Anyway, after looking it up, unfortunately, this bag only goes for like $45 on eBay. Kind of a bummer. So we're going to go ahead and let this one be donated and Salvation Army can make a little bit of money and someone can get a great deal on that. But it is padded, has a shoulder pad, has handle straps and everything. It is a little uh, dusty on the wheels. So I think this was some in someone's storage for quite a while and that's why they hucked it because they just weren't using it. So I wanted to show that to you again before we did donate that. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I've mentioned it before, but if you are not following me on the Instagram hammer, which is Instagram, but I call it the Insta Hammer or the Insta, which is linked in the description box below, or you can just search my name, Chris Bensberg. I upload funny stories, I upload videos from the gym, I upload pictures from beautiful Colorado, and I'm gonna start doing some sneak peeks of dumpster diving finds. So if you are following me on Instagram, probably I have already posted it a long time ago by the time this comes out, that hoverboard I just found, I'm gonna give you some sneak peeks of some things I find in my Insta stories. So follow me on the Instagram for some special unedited content. Well, that was a very nice love seat. I didn't see the cushions around. Maybe someone took those or maybe they're gonna come down later on. And also a very nice, looked like kind of designer leather backed uh, padded headboard with chrome. And then here, real quickly, we have ourselves what looks to be a futon or a pullout. Uh, I think that actually might be a kind of a metal frame with the wooden things for a mattress. This is my after church complex here. Let's go ahead and press on forward. Look at this huge painting, my goodness gracious. That thing is serious big. What's that back over there? Hold on. Whoa. 
Wow! That was probably really expensive back in the day, but for a clean one large pizza, we'll be able to give that to you only $9.95 per month for one month. Don't let the party stop, guys. Hit one of these videos, continue to watch, and we'll see you soon.